So guys, you're welcome. In order for us to um, start working with Facebook, we need to actually create a Facebook. You make sure you're logged into your Facebook and we're going to create an app uh, from Facebook. So go to developers.facebook.com and create an app. So I think I should call this voting app. That's what I'm going to have to call mine. So once you're logged into Facebook and um, you come to this page, it, they might require you to sign up. If you've never been here, they will ask you to sign up for this. So go to apps and uh, create add, click on add new app. And what are we going to call our app? I'm going to call mine Laravel voting app. You get what I'm saying? So this is the name that will be displayed. So I'm just going to call mine voting. App. Remember, you can change this at any time. Um, create app ID, and it's gonna ask you for your Facebook password. Okay, no, it's gonna it's gonna ask you to enter the words you're seeing. I'm trying to enter mine B Y T H. Of course, there's a point to ask you for your Facebook password, and it's redirecting me, as you can see here. And this is super cool so we're trying to install it's asking us what thing what kind of app do we want to create so um, I have other tutorials on this on how to work out all these things but generally right now we just want to create a Facebook login so we'll click on setup and um, we're right here we want to log in from the web as you can see use the quick start to add facebook login to your app uh you may want to have this in your ios your android but now we're looking for web so click on this so it's, it's asking me the site url for now uh our site url is actually uh localhost so we're gonna do localhost you see eight thousand the reason why I know it's localhost 8000 is because that's what our server is running and look at our server started at see localhost 8000 this 127.0.0.1 means is the same thing as just typing localhost in words say localhost is the same thing 127.0.0.1 but Facebook may not accept this they prefer you write it as localhost so I'll save but the thing is, you, you should come back here and edit this after you've hosted your application. Let's say your ap application has been hosted and, um, in a website and the website's name is devpartner.com. So what you're supposed to enter here is devpartner.com. But since we're still working from localhost, uh, we're, still, we're just going to say that this is localhost. Okay, so we're going to do continue. So this is the Facebook SDK expecting us to paste this. Now we don't need all this uh, because we're going to use a specific Laravel application. All these other settings um, isn't really necessary for us. We're going to go straight to um, basic, basic settings. exactly this is what we're looking for so we need this and that so but before then we need to go to laravel to install something called socialite then we can come back here and copy all these details that we may need all right so we will return to that application but for now let's get back to our laravel visit laravel.com slash doc slash 5.6 and in order to avoid having a very long video i'll stop this video here but in the next video we are going to come to official packages and install uh, Laravel Socialite. All right, click on Socialite. So see you guys in the next video.